Howdy. It's been a while. I figured I'd uh, explain why and what's been going on. I think you guys deserve a, uh, just a little insight. I have been fired. I lost my job back in February, the week of my birthday. And it took me a long time to find another job, two, three, maybe four months uh, before I started working again. It was, it was not easy and I slipped into a lot of debt and I'm still in kind of a lot of debt right now. And uh, my roommates moved out. I pretty much live by myself now. I'm trying to get out of here. I actually don't, I barely even live here anymore because I haven't paid my rent since I lost my job. And I went into so much debt that all my money I've been making at my new job has been going towards trying to pay everything off. And uh, it's, it's being a real struggle. I'm not getting a lot of hours. I love my job. It's very easy. Um, the wages are okay. But um, I never planned on getting into tech. I finally got into tech after being born and raised in the Bay Area all my life. Never did any tech. Now I'm, now I'm in tech. <clears throat> After 13 years of construction working for the same guy, he said to me, I'm gonna require the, you know, the uh, shot. You're getting the shot if you wanna keep working for me. And I said, the hell I am. And he said, well, then you're gonna have to find other means of employment. So that was that, and I stopped working. From, uh, I was able to collect unemployment, but um, it's been really tough. Also, I got not just Morgan now. I ended up finding this little sparrow. Mr. Gold calls him Peep Peep. I call it Jackie. Jackie Sparrow. It is the cutest little thing. But yeah, I got this sparrow I've been looking after. And, hold on one sec. <laughs> this is Kukolin. I don't want to clip Kukulin's wings, so I pretty much just keep him in the house, homebound, and he flies around the house. She, he or she, I don't know. So yeah, I got three birds I'm looking after now. I have very little income and a mountain of bills, and so I've been... <clears throat> I, I know I really want to bring you guys some videos. I did end up going to an event that we had a couple months ago. I did do a video on it because... <clears throat> um, Ellen was Ellen Lee Wu. Uh, she ran for mayor in San Francisco. She was there and she 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 was kind of the, expecting me to do some videos when she saw me and I went ahead and recorded it. Obviously, I didn't upload it on YouTube, but it, it's out there if you want to look for it. Um, it's just a little short clip of video of what we did. It's it's not really like the kind of the work I I usually do. And I definitely do want to get back out there again and do some more, but uh, right now it is definitely not priority on top of not as many things happening and whatever. It's definitely not my priority right now. So yeah, so many different things. Losing my job, between losing my job and having to find another one, and my roommate, you know, my brother, he's gone. I just live here right now, and I haven't paid rent, like I said, since since I lost my job. Uh, the only reason I'm still able to live here is because of Gavin. He's actually allowing everybody to live here, live in California rent-free for at least until uh, October 1st. So it can go for quite a while. And I'm gonna try and ride that out for as long as I can because if I if I had to pay rent right now, there is just no freaking way that uh, I don't I don't know I don't know I would be done. I really have no idea. How I, it, 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 I don't even want to think about what what things would be like actually. Um, so I gotta move. I don't really know where I'm gonna move to. I have a, I have had had have I don't a place lined up. But I'm realizing that if, even if, if I had moved there now and they're expecting me to move in there next month, I just don't think I can do it because it's a, it's, it's a thousand dollars for a room in a stranger's house. I, at first I thought I could do a thousand dollars. I can't do it. I can't pay a thousand dollars a month. I don't make that. I don't make that money. I don't make that kind of money. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm just almost feeling like I'm, I'm, 
I, I'm basically being ran out of town. I don't even think I can stay here in California before. Before I was telling you guys I wanted to, I wanted to leave California. I wanted to go somewhere, but I didn't have a plan. Now it's looking like I have to. I just can't do this anymore. I don't. Uh, I don't have. I don't have the funds. I don't have the finances, and uh, things are just. They're just. It's, they're asking too much. My landlord asks too much. The state asks too much. It's just too much. So I'm looking for incentives. I'm looking at incentives to move someplace else. I have a couple places in mind. If you guys have any suggestions, if you can show me something like a good incentive to move there, uh, like what I'm looking at, then please put it in the description below. I could really use the help and the advice and the information. Uh, otherwise, well, I don't even think about it otherwise. It's the plan. That's the plan. Got to do what I got to do. The kids are obviously coming with me. The sparrow, I would like to find another home for it, as much as that little thing loves me to death. Um, I'm not really a sparrow guy. And uh, I think that's about it. I think we're all caught up. Yeah. All right. Thanks for watching. Now, now you guys know what's going on. Everything is okay. For the most part. Just got to get my head above water, and I will bring you more content Again, I'll start going to these events again. There is another event coming up actually this month on the 24th. I am going to try and hit that up. Yeah, my phone is actually off. I don't even have service. Everything is <laughs> shut down for me right now. So even when I go out and I do these videos, I can't like I can't do a live stream. I don't can't live stream. I have no phone carrier. And that's what's necessary right now until until I get my shit together. Until then, wish me luck. Adios, guys.